Hey, Wax Up guys, welcome to the Cine Academy. And in this video, I'm going to show you how I fixed the display surface initialization failed error that prevented me from launching Premiere Pro. This error is very frustrating and can happen for various reasons, such as a corrupted cache, a faulty driver, or a compatibility issue. I even uninstalled and reinstalled Premiere Pro from Creative Cloud, but that didn't help either. I tried to find a solution on Google, but I couldn't find anything that worked for me. Then I stumbled upon the Adobe Community Forum where I saw that many other people were also facing the same problem and were desperate for a fix. That's when I decided to do some more research and find a solution that I could share with all of you. But then I discovered a workaround that solved the problem for me. Here's what I did. First, I uninstalled Premiere Pro again from Creative Cloud. Then, I went to the Creative Cloud app and clicked on the icon next to Premiere Pro. I selected other versions and chose to install version 23.04 instead of the latest version 23.05. After the installation was complete, I launched Premiere Pro and it worked fine. No more error message. Finally, I went back to Creative Cloud and updated Premiere Pro to version 23.05 from there. And that's it. Now I have the latest version of Premiere Pro working smoothly on my PC. I don't know why this method worked, but it did. Maybe there was something wrong with the direct installation of version 23.05 that caused the error. I hope this video was helpful for you. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. And before you go, I have a small favor to ask you. Please subscribe to my channel, Cine Academy, where I post more videos like this one to help you with your video editing skills. It would mean a lot to me and motivate me to create more content for you. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more Premiere Pro tutorials. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.